What's going on? Turn the fam! Video number two on the birthday, August 9th. It's my birthday. Big 29, getting old. Getting old here with the landing. What's up, what's up? We gon' I'm gonna crack open this mystery tackle box. He gonna use regular stuff, but I'm gonna use mystery tackle box. We're gonna go do a slam, slam dunk out here in this clear water. Out here by Shoal Point right now, but we're gonna go somewhere else. We was out here striper fishing as you've seen in the video from yesterday. If you ain't watch that one, go check that one out and come back to this one. Anyway guys, we're gonna crack open this mystery tackle box, see what's inside, tie some baits on, go catch some fish. Let's do it. Yee -yee. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, we got the box. Let's open it up. I done took a little peek inside before. But we got some little bubblegumish flake trick worms from Catch Co. That should be an easy catch. They actually sent you a catalog this time with old Carl on it. Check that out later. Yeah, you got your what's inside. We got an Elvis Presley bass sticker, the dibble. And we got Deer Fellow Angler. So they get they sent you a thank you card this week. Alright, we got some three R offset worm hooks. It's gonna be good for them worms. We got an excite bait square bill. It's got like a flat bottom with a taper on it. It's not no, it's not a square bill. It's just a regular crankbait. But it should have a pretty tight action on it. Should definitely catch one on that. We got some KVD Perfect Plastics rodent. Green pumpkin. That should get bit. And we got some Carl's bait uh bobble stops. So I'm gonna tie some stuff up and let's go catch a fish. One to zero. He's using a green pumpkin Texas rig. It's little, but it counts. See, I won't be. That's a world record right there. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we'll count it. We'll count it. We'll count it. We'll count it. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna throw this worm around a little bit more. Oh, I'm throwing it on this little swing jig. I'm gonna save that three out hook in the pack for the. Uh, Oh, right, that's why he bent my he bent the hook out. <laughs> I might have to change anyway. That's why he got off, guys. I dogged him too much. He wasn't that big though. He was only about two pounds. <laughs> Darn it! Yeah, right, I think we're gonna count that one. If I catch some more on the other stuff and I got time, I'll go back and redo that beat. We're gonna go ahead and put the rodent on with the pig. So we're gonna rig up the KVD rodent, green pumpkin, three out. I'd rather have a EWG hook, but gotta do the challenge. Probably gonna put it on like a 116 out weight. Alright, bait number two done. He wanted that thing too. 
There we go. We got the peg stop, the rodent, and the three out hooks in his mouth. Let me get him off. It's a fat one. He about messed up. It almost went too deep, but he should be good to go. All right, now we got the crankbait. And we'll be done, but I'm going to redo the worm probably. Got him. <laughs> Striper. <laughs> Good one, too. Come on, MTB Slam Striper. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Crankbait in his mouth. Let's go! You can drop it. <laughs> Jesus! Yeah, one hook, too. All right. I'm gonna try to catch one of this worm now. If not, I mean slam complete, right? <laughs> we wasn't even striper fishing. We done caught stripers today. Oh. All right, guys. It is freaking hot out here. Woo. It's like 11 o'clock. It's probably like 100 degrees. Welcome to the south. We didn't get any on that final worm, but I mean, we had one right at the boat, so we're gonna count that one and say we got the slam done. <laughs> but, caught another striper. So now I gotta take him home. Give uh, to my dad, because I gave him the other five before he left this morning. Because he just came out here striper fishing. So, but the bass, I mean, the ones we caught were on a point about five to ten feet of water really i mean it was, it was a point it had like grass but it was like rocks between the grass anyway guys if you enjoyed the video hit the thumbs up for me it means a lot let me know what kind of videos you want down below and we go yeah yeah <laughs> catch y'all next time